The significance of one millionth machine is really that we, we've made one hell of a lot of machines through the years. It's an achievement more than anything of our worldwide grasp and our dealer network worldwide. We have always reinvested in our business. We haven't taken profits and put them elsewhere. We've concentrated on the business and, and it's there to be seen. Now we have 11 plants uh, in Britain and 11 plants overseas. We're really up there, the very top manufacturers in the world. We're making more machines per annum than, than Jaguar cars is, for instance. I've learnt so much along the way and, and obviously I've, I've been in a very privileged position. I've been running the business now for, for 35 years. I've got a fabulous team of people around me and I think probably the most important ingredient is the people in the business and then the products. But you can't have one with, without the other. Uh, why is innovation so important? Innovation is really sort of part of our makeup as, as a business. It's innovation in product, it's innovation in, in methods as well, and innovation in manufacturing. We are looking for our products to be different but have benefits to the customer. That's what it's all about. A lot of thoughts on products actually come from the customers. And we learn so much from customers. We also learn from our dealers. And it's that partnership that we hold very dear to ourselves. We have to bear in mind that we have some of our dealers have been with us now for since the late 50s. 60 years in business together is, is pretty unusual these days. It's longer than most marriages. So Anthony, can I ask you a question? What JCB innovation has inspired you most? I mean, innovation comes in all sorts of ways. Certainly one of them which is, is fascinating to me is uh, something which we call lively, which is, is telemetry, which basically means that we can know and our dealers can know and the customer can know uh, live where the machine is, where it is working, what it's doing, and it's been a great help with, with um, machines being stolen as well. Sir Anthony, let me ask you a question. Um, where do you see future growth coming from? We are looking at growth. We've got ambitious targets uh, for the next five years, which we uh, are talking to our dealers about at this very moment. We are very concerned about their profitability, of being involved with them to make sure they're profitable. Uh, and in return, we want them to sell more machines uh, for us, and we will back the machines up in a better way than any other competitor in, in, in the world, not only in the product, but also in the parts and service backup as well. They need to understand that we're ambitious to grow, that we want them very much to come to the party with us, and from their success, our success will come. Our future is uh, extremely bright, and as far as I can see it, it's all yellow. <laughs> <laughs>